Hey, love bugs, it's Roz, I'm back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed. I'm doing blessed and highly favored, and I definitely hope the same for you. And if this is our first time coming to my channel, much love to you and welcome. And to my returning subs, my growing, extended, beautiful family, just thank you so much um, just for being there, being supportive. Um, and I'm being supportive towards y'all. So, you know, with all that going on, you know, we need so much love and encouragement in our lives. You know, we don't need to have that negative. We already got neg enough negative stuff going on. So with us sending out, you know, positive uh, vibes and, you know, we're reciprocating is truly a blessing. So with that being said, much love to all. Namaste, love and blessings, love and light. And many blessings are definitely coming your way. Also, if you've been watching my videos for a while, I have not already. What are you waiting for? A like and subscribe. Even hit that notification bell at the bottom, especially if you want to watch, you know, know when I'm about to upload my next video. And if you feel like you're comfortable enough, please go ahead and drop me a line or two. I love the chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me, even if it's about the positive feedback or the content of my video. Or you're just up telling me about your impact, the gift, and how it impacted your life and heading you towards a positive direction. And if you feel like the videos gave you good vibes or just good information, you would love to share with a loved one or friend, please go ahead and do so. And while you're at it, give me a thumbs up, like, and even share on your social media favorites, wherever you see fit. And once again, thank you so much for the love and support you give me and show the channel. And I hope you're able to, you know, resonate with the content of my video today. Y'all, I have this... Oh my gosh, I love these meditations. It's called Let Go of Subconscious Guilt, Worry, Anxiety, Bitterness, and Frustration and Resentment by Nario Beats. And I will post that link in the description box below. And as once again, it is Buddha. I love, I don't know why, but I love to see a lot of Buddha images. It just gives me a piece of calmness. You know, that's why I try to show it to y'all, you know, and give you that image or even, you know, trying to put that vibe that goes in the video with the words that I'm saying. Plus, I want y'all to hear, feel that 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 energy that's coming through, just to relax you. I know a lot of people sell, tell me that my videos sound like MSR videos. I can't stand that. But you know, if it's a good thing to y'all, thank you. <laughs> you know, if they, I can't stand to hear people smacking or chewing and stuff like that, because I know a lot of people do those MSR videos when they eat, and it drives me nuts. But if it's like meditation or something like that, I love those. But anyways, the video today I'm doing is, let me see, I got so many ones right, written down right now. Okay, hey Oka's uh, Twin Flame 101. Hey Oka's, nothing happens by chance. Pay attention to the signs. You know, it's just like, oh my goodness, there's so many things that happen to our, us in our lives that, you know, you could be on your way to work and there's just that one day that you decide to go an opposite direction because you left a little early. So, you know, I'm going to take this long drive so I can just clear my mind. And it just so happened that day that you, if you would have took the regular route, you would have been in this you know, there could have been a really bad accident. You would have stuck, been stuck in a pileup or something like that. And I've heard that. I remember I've watched videos when people had that happen to them or, you know, something tells them to stop. Like I've even seen videos where the guy was like uh, doing this, you know, uh, skate skateboard trick. And next, you know, something told him to veer off to this side. Next, you know, if you would have went that way, he would have got smashed by a car. So it's just like, you know, there are sometimes is, you know, God forbid is our time. But then there are some times that, you know, we are sent from the powers that be, spirit guides, like I say, whoever y'all, you know, you relate to in your religious, spiritual side. I'm not really religious. I'm not even a religious person. I'm very spiritual. Um, I respect anybody's, you know, beliefs or whatever that they do, but I'm just very spiritual. It's just like if I go to church, I, you know, I've tried to go to church and I feel really antsy, feel like I'm closed off and can't deal with it. I'm, you know, people are like, oh, you ought to come to church. Ah, uh, no, I can't. I just, I've tried it. I did Episcopal. I did Methodist. I did Baptist. Baptist, I did Catholic, and I just can't do it, you know, it's just like, oh my God, I'm like, even if it's for an hour or 45 minutes, like, oh my God, I'm ready to go, like, this is, just, you know, 45 minutes is just too long for me, and, you know, I don't know why I've been that way, but, you know, everything happens for a reason, you know, it's just like, I've been blessed with meeting so many new people that are coming to my channel, and, you know, they're, 
they are reciprocating with the things that I talk about. And they're like, oh my gosh, I'm so glad I found your channel. And that really makes me feel good because there's sometimes, it's like when I do my videos, I'm like, I hope they get this, you know, because sometimes I can talk in riddles. But y'all get it every single time, you know, and it's just like, you're like, Rosa, I can totally relate or I've had this or, you know, you don't make me look at something in a different way. And that's my blessing. You know, like I told you, there's times where I don't, it don't drove me nuts for me having to take off a few days well enough alone that big month you don't know how many times i was sat here and cried and i'm like i don't want to lose you know the people that i have and it wasn't about likes it wasn't about the ratings or views it's just because y'all hold a special part in my heart and i'm not going to get emotional because i felt it coming i'm like no <laughs> don't do it because there's times y'all i don't woke up in the middle of the night and y'all left me some uh comments and y'all had me in tears and that's when you do that that's what keeps me going that's what makes me want to get up more content that's what makes me want to be able to touch bases on everything and i know a lot of my videos especially since i've been back it's been about hayokas because if you know you've been with me for a while you know i do uh i did probably a couple of infjs i can't remember i, I got almost a thousand videos out close to so it's just so many videos i got out you know i did wiccan videos and i was scared to do wiccan videos but there's people that are out there that are wiccan wiccans they're uh witches pagans you know so i want to be able to you know expand my viewpoint towards everything to help be able to help people on whatever platform they're going on you know because it's just a lot of people they don't you know that you know they didn't know that they were witches and i was like uh you know you're a witch you know because people were like oh i do the ricky thing and it's just like and i say uh well you need to go ahead and do this too because it's like with me it's like i'm an empath catalog so if i um, if i'm on a one-on-one -on -one with you or you're telling me about a situation that you're in and i can feel like you're you know because it's just a lot of times you can come into my channel and it's just like I always ask God, if people are, you know, coming in or going through these awakenings, can you please send them my way so I can be able to help them? And, you know, every time I ask for that is more and more y'all keep coming in. And I love to be able to help people because you can be, okay, I'm just an INFJ and all of a sudden you found out you're, you're an indigo or you just found out you had a twin flame or you just found out that you might be a pagan or and stuff like that. And it's just like, it's amazing for me to be able to do things like that. So it's just like, you know, I'm a library catalog of different empaths. So, you know, I'm like, hey, you're this or hey, you're that. And you're like, well, I was like, how do you know all these things? And I said, look, let me go ahead and send you these links or I'm going to send you one of my videos and you let me know if you all these characteristics you know fall in the category of you next thing you know you've got more and more category you know more and more gifts that you know um that works for you or you find out that, that these are the things you're dealing with and that could be a lot to take on but at least you know where you stand out in the world at least you know hey this is the reason why i do these things and it can put you know take a lot of pressure off of you it might you know give you a state of shock for a minute because that you know a lot of things i don't found out myself i'm like oh hell no are you serious you know and the next thing you know i'm just like you know what it's a blessing so it's just like when everything happens to you is never by chance you know even the, the the bs you might go through and you know you can be really going through some stuff like you know you know sometimes we get stuck in these abusive relationships like my situation is abusive relation relationship but my abusive relationship has taught me so much how to be strong how to love myself have self-respect for myself to you know sometimes you got to turn the other cheek you know just as you know a response to a fool is just no response at all <laughs> you know and then it's just like when i see other people going through it i was like you know what i'm not gonna judge you but don't come at me with no best if i'm telling you you need to leave that person don't come up with all these excuses because i'm not gonna deal with it you know it's hurting me to see you go through that when you don't have to you know and it's certain you know with my situation i can't leave you know because my my mine is karmic I have to be able to heal from every aspect that there is for me to be able to walk out of that. So it's something that it takes a lot of patience to deal with. So, but it's just like, I'm glad I went through it because it lets me know what to look for. If somebody tries to pull a fast one on me, or if you're trying to get played, you know, you have to look at your situations like that. Nothing's never by chance. You pick this person or, you know, that person picked you and you, you allowed them to come in your life and you, you're trying to figure out how am I going to get myself out? You have to really sit there and see all of the things and reason why you went through what you went through because you have to look at the big picture.
and nothing happens by chance because whatever you're going through in life it don't taught you something so it's just like when you ask why you why not you <laughs> why i got put in this way situation okay you got to put in this situation now how are you going to get out of it you know, you have to look at everything that you have been through in life, what the lessons you learned from it. You know, sometimes it can make us bitter. It can put us, make walls up. It even can give us mental illnesses from the situations we got to go through. But you have to be able to look at it from a different way. Look at it as a positive perspective. What can you learn from this? What, what, what can you take from this situation? What has it taught you? So just pay attention to the signs that you're getting each and every day and knowing there's a reason behind everything you go through. So I hope you're able to resonate with the content of my video. And I hope everybody, you know, just has a blessed, safe day. And many blessings and uplifting blessings to all. Sit down as much love and light and positivity as you possibly can. Know that you are truly blessed, highly favored, and forever loved. And there's always somebody out there praying for your better days. And my post notification shout out goes to um, Daily Holidays and Whitney Schrader and Black Jack. Much love to you. Many blessings to y'all, and I will talk to you on my next video. Y'all stay blessed, stay highly favored, and I will talk to you later. You know, give me a like, thumbs up, share a video, drop me a line, and let me know what's up with you. And I would love to hear back from you. You know, I'm going to go ahead and turn your uh, the reply to your comment. And I'll see you on the next video. Much love. Peace. Be wild.